Hello, this is Tyler with Optimize, and today we're gonna to be looking at how to use your air-cooled Generac generator control panel. This control panel here on this front panel can be used to access all kinds of information about your generator, such as when the next maintenance is, how many run hours are on it, battery condition and status history. All very useful pieces of information to ensure that your generator is healthy and will work the next time you need it. So if you come over here, the first thing we're gonna do is look at the uh, main screen. So most often, this is the first thing you'll see, which is telling you the current status of the generator, which is ready to run, and hours of protection. Hours of protection is simply how long the generator has been activated and ready to go for. It is not a representation of your run hours or how long the generator has ran for. So to access the main menu, the first thing you're gonna do is hit the escape button. And from there, you'll have four main options. System, date and time, Wi-Fi or set up Wi-Fi, and submenus. System, if you press enter, will lead you right back to the main status position, escape. Date and time will of course tell you the current date and time. Wi-Fi will explain your Wi-Fi connectivity state, whether you're connected or disconnected from your home Wi-Fi. And submenus will allow you to access more information about the generator. So to scroll through these menu items, you're gonna use the up arrow the enter button in the down arrow. So we're gonna press the down arrow a few times until we see submenu start blinking. Once it starts blinking, you can press the enter button to access that menu. And from there you have history, maintenance, edit, and dealer. History, we're gonna press enter on, and that will give us an alarm log and a run log. These two positions will contain the status history of the generator. Alarm log will tell you every uh, alarm or error code or warning that the generator has thrown since its activation. And run log will also display every time the generator has ran for. Escape is gonna act as your back button. So press escape to go to the previous menu. You can press down to go to maintenance and we're gonna press enter. From there, you have battery information, run hours, maintenance log, and scheduled, which stands for scheduled maintenance or the next maintenance that is scheduled for. Battery, we're gonna press enter on, and that will tell you whether the battery condition is good or bad. A yellow light will appear when the battery condition is recommended to be replaced or inspected. Escape, again, to go back. We're gonna press the down arrow one time, and we're gonna access run hours by pressing enter. And from there, you can see that this generator has 184 run hours. Escape again to go back. Escape again to go back. And one more time, we're gonna hit escape to go back to the main menu. Now from there, you can press the system button to go all the way back to the beginning. And now you know how to access all the pieces of information you need to know how your generator is performing. Thank you for trusting Optimize, the generator people.